Hello again and welcome back to Stay Inspired. Today's episode we're going to do a little let's draw of Harley Quinn because, you know, she's gorgeous. To start the piece I use rough construction lines just to base in where everything's going to go. Essentially I'm drawing a skeleton and then adding the meat around the bones. This is really helpful. It allows you to rough out poses and see how they're going to look without committing to any final details. When you have blocked in where everything's going to go, you can start adding the details, such as the eyes and the nose and the mouth, bits of clothing and jewellery that she's going to wear. And then it's simply a case of layering things up until you're happy with it. When you are happy with how everything looks, you can start inking it. I use Unipin fine liners. For this, I used a 0.3. And you can start doing a basic outline just to solidify what you've already drawn in. At the point when everything is inked in, I would usually erase the construction lines underneath so the piece is really clean and fine. But for this, I thought Harley's a little bit gritty. She's a little bit dark, so I thought I'd leave the pencil lines in just to add a little bit more depth into the piece. I should also say at this point that for some reason my uh, webcam quality wasn't acting the way I wanted it to, so I had to uh, adjust the contrast uh, whilst recording so that you could see the pencil lines in the final uh, video. Using the Copic markers, I was able to sort of blend the colours in how I wanted the reds and the blues to create a sort of a gradient effect to add that extra dimension into the final piece. Okay, so that's the final piece. I'm really happy with how it came out. Um, let me know what you think. And again, if you're at it, you might as well like and subscribe and stay inspired.